Hello children. In this lesson we are going to learn how to find surface area of solid shapes mainly cubes and cuboids. So let's take some solid shapes of cubes and cuboids. Here is a cuboid and here is a cube. Right? It's a 3D shape. Cube has length, breadth, height all same. Cuboids have length, breadth, height as separate. Right? So think about cuboid is a three-dimensional shape of a rectangle and cube is a three-dimensional shape of a two-dimensional shape cube. Right? And say we need to find its surface area. What does surface area means? Surface area means the area of each of its surfaces. Right? So as we have seen in our earlier lesson, we can actually open or unfold these 3D shapes like cuboid or evenly pyramid here. And when we unfold them and we open each of its sides, they become 2D shapes, two-dimensional shapes. And then we can find the area of each of them and sum it and that becomes a surface area of this three-dimensional shape. Right? So let's start with a cuboid. Let's say here is a cuboid room. Think about it. A closed room. Right? And we need to paint its wall. Right? And we need to find out how much paint which will require. Right? So we need to find the area of each of the walls. Right? So let's say the length of this cuboid is L, the breadth is B and the height which is a ceiling from base to the ceiling is H. This is a room. Right? So it has six faces, this and back side of it, this and back side of this, this and below of it. So what we can do is we can find the area of each of these. We can sum it. We can find the surface area, the entire surface is the area of the surfaces of this cuboid. So let's start with the side which is facing the screen, which is this side of length L and height H. Its area is will be the area of the rectangle length into H is the height. So L into H will be this side. And same way back side which you can see the dotted line this, this dotted line and this solid line and this solid line. If you can visualize, take any box what you have in your classroom and you can try this. So this is the front side and this is the back side. They both have area of L into H. Right? So these are the two faces, this side and that back side. Same way the sides having area as B into H, right? B into H, right? And this side also, other, other side, right side is also B into H. So the area is B into H here, B into H here. And the area of top and bottom, what you see in the top of the box or top of the room, this is L into B, L into B, and this is also L into B, right? So these are all the six sides of this cuboid and their areas. So if we sum them, we can get the surface area of this entire cuboidal shape, which is going to be 2 times L into B. Remember L into B, this L into B and this L into B, plus 2 times L into H, right? This L into H and the front one, and 2 times B into H, the sides ones. So these are the six sides, and we have taken each area L into B twice, L into H twice and B into H twice. And if we take two common, it is two times LB plus LH plus BH. So that becomes the surface area of cuboids. So that is how much amount of paint you are going to require. Let's take an example. Let's say there is a cuboid shape with length of three meters, breadth of two meters and height of 3.5 meters. How much, what will be its surface area? We put in the formula two times 3 into 2 plus 3 into 3.5 plus 2 into 3.5, right? LB, BH, LH. And this is nothing but 2 into 6. 3 into 3.5 is 10.5. 2 into 3.5 is 7. When we sum these things, we get 23.5. And 2 into 23.5 is 47. 47 square meters. Assuming these three are in meters. Now let's try to find a surface area of cube. We know cube is like a cuboid except length is equal to breadth equal to height. And we know the surface area of cuboid is twice, two times 
bracket LB plus LH plus BH and because L and B and H are same let's say it's A it becomes very easy 2 times LB A into A BH A into A LH A into A right everything is same as A in cube all length breadth height are same right so what we get 2 times a square plus a square plus a square a into a is a square a into a is a square a into a is a square so this becomes 3 a square 2 times 3 a square and 2 into 3 is 6 a square so a cube of side a will have surface area of 6 a square remember surface area the sum of area of each side this this back side this back side top and bottom let's take an example here is a cube with 12 cm as the side. All sides are 12 cm long. So its surface area would be 6 a square. 6 into sides. 6 into 12 square. 12 square means 12 into 12 which is 144. 6 into 144 is 864 square centimeter. Because this was in centimeter, area will be square centimeter. 864 square centimeter. So what we have learned in this lesson surface area of cuboid is 2 times bracket LB plus BH plus LH and surface area of cube is 6 times A squared where A is the length of its side. That's all in this lesson children. Bye bye.